This is Max Williams with United Real Estate, and today I'm in the city of Richmond. More specifically, I am in, in South Richmond, and today we're going to take a look at a three-bedroom, one-and-a-half bath home. This home is special indeed. We are located in a neighborhood that is made up primarily of what we refer to in the business as starter homes. And uh, when people think of starter homes, they typically think of cozy homes that are pretty basic. And uh, the home that we're gonna see today is far from basic. This is undoubtedly the most stylish home on the market today, under 300,000. And I wanna make sure that I purposefully bring you homes that are not only of all price ranges, but also of many different levels of renovation and even rehab properties. I'm not afraid to bring you something that's bare down to the studs. And uh, this home today really, really shines. We can see here we have a double lot and this is great because if you are an outdoors person, you wanna have a garden, you wanna have a place for four-legged or two-legged friends to be able to go out and play, you can. Uh, we have a nice big lot here. These are typically smaller urban lots, so it's really nice to have a double lot. We've got a great front elevation here. Notice the ironwork. This is ironwork that we typically don't see in uh, this part of town. Uh, we see this ironwork more so in Church Hill and in Jackson Ward, and it is absolutely stunning. It just makes a fabulous architectural statement on a home like this. Okay, as we look down the side of the home, for those of you that are frequent viewers, you know that this unit is called a pack unit. And what that basically means is it is a combination indoor and outdoor unit. Normally on a central heat and air system, you have an outdoor and an indoor unit. This is all combined. I know that it's gas fired because I have a natural gas line right there that goes all the way to the gas meter. So we heat with nice, efficient natural gas. That uh, unit is great because you now have a quiet unit. You don't have a noisy inside unit uh, running somewhere in a closet. Here on the side, we have a door with brand new set of steps. We have walking stones all the way back to the parking area. And we do have a nice big storage building back there and a brand new deck here on the rear. This home is staged and we've got a little sitting area back here with a fire pit. I'm gonna give you a shot here from the rear elevation. That slider is actually to the primary suite and uh, you are definitely gonna be impressed when you see uh, what that suite has to offer. This home is unique for a, a few reasons. Uh, it is not only a recent renovation, but it is a renovation that was purposeful. Uh, when the rehabber came in, they took into account the period. Uh, this is a Greek revival architecture style, affectionately known as the shotgun. And we see this style uh, predominantly in Charleston and some other cities like Charleston. Uh, this is definitely a unique offering here in Metro Richmond. Okay, when we come up to the front door, we've got a nice heavy iron security door. This home is wired for an alarm system. Let's go on in and take a look. This home is offered with the option to actually get the furnishings. Uh, you can negotiate that and um, I'm sure by the time we're done, you will say this home is perfect just like it is. You could leave your lazy boy and other furniture at home. Just purchase this one already furnished and just bring your suitcase and your food and you'll be good to go. I've got a closet right there at the front door. Notice all of the different finishes. We've got finishes that are not builder grade. Uh, they have come in here and uh, just done some really nice work. Special shout out to the rehabber. We're actually gonna give her a shout out. We're gonna put her information up here and uh, we're gonna put it at the end too. So if you have a need, uh, she definitely is a true professional. This is unique. We typically don't see this, but these are our before images. And you can see we had a very colorful yellow and red kitchen, uh, very colorful rooms here indeed. So she has definitely uh, come in and, and done some amazing work. Okay, let's start here on the left side. We have a nice archway here. This is a pretty unique architectural style. And on this side of the home, we actually have 
two bedrooms and our full bath. We're gonna start here at the front of the home. We've got nice tall ceilings. All of these bedrooms, I do believe, have ceiling fans. Beautiful wood floors. These wood floors have refinished very nicely and they just have character. Uh, you can feel the warmth in this bedroom. Uh, I love the sliding door that she decided to put there and um, it just really helps with the styling here. And it's actually functional because you don't have a door swinging and uh, causing problems with uh, placement of furniture. Okay, our full bath, we've got a nice refinished tub there. Our wainscoting on the wall and our pedestal sink there in the rear. I'm gonna come on in here and give you a shot. Look at that, every inch of this house has interesting details and uh, it is dual shower head technology there. You guys know I'm a big fan of that. Keep you nice and clean. We're gonna come out and we're actually going to go to the left. This is going to be the second bedroom. This is a secondary bedroom. We've got good natural light that flows in here. This one is going to feature a walk-in closet. So something very unusual in this size home. So you've got good storage space there. Give you a shot here from the other angle. And I'm gonna go back now to the family room area. And here to a left, of course, is our kitchen and dining room area. We've got really good space here for uh, a dinette. And look at the interesting light fixture there. That is really something. This is, um, this, this reminds me of a Airbnb that you would see someplace that had uh, professional decorating and just really made a statement when you go on the website and you just say, oh, I've got to stay there. Beautiful exposed brick here, right here in the middle. Uh, that's a nice design element. Of course, we're moving now into our kitchen. They did some interesting choices here. We've got wainscoting. That tan box there, that is actually our range hood. And so uh, that was nicely hidden right above our smooth top. We've got quartz on the countertop. And then on this side, of course, is going to be our nice deep farmhouse sink. I love the choice of fixtures here. The black, the white, and the uh, brass all work together very beautifully. And look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that. All right, so you know if you got this home, you'd have to get all new dishes, or you could actually just buy the dishes that are there and um, leave them in place. Okay, directly ahead is going to be our oversized laundry. And of course, you see these appliances. If you want those, I'm sure that they can convey with the house as well. So we've got a good storage area here. Our door going out to the side and a cabinet unit right there. This is gonna, of course, take us back to our bedroom wing so you can uh, easily access the bedrooms and the mudroom here from the side of the home. I'm now taking you into our primary suite and it is here on the rear of the home. This is going to be our powder room. Inside of that bifold door is a water heater. And I just love the color selection here. Uh, this home just feels so warm and homey. Uh, here in the primary suite, we have a plenty of space. I believe that's gonna be a full-size bed, but you could easily get a, a queen or even a king in there. And just plenty of space. If you wanted to do a little seating area, you could. Nice big bay window. You, of course, could put curtains there or you could just leave it like it is and just have all this light flowing in uh, if that is what you desire all right nice big primary suite this is something you typically are not going to get in a style home like this so the renovation the floor plan uh, just works so beautifully well together and then if you want to step out you can do it right here out the back of your primary suite Wow, this was a real treat. Um, hats off to the uh, listing agent who was kind enough to allow us to come in, my friend Leah Coleman. She is an amazing agent. And of course, her client who did this project is uh, very talented as well. I am just blown away. Boy, Richmond has some real gems and um,
I'm just honored to bring them to you here on a weekly basis. If you have questions about this or any other home in the market, my name is Max Williams. It'd be an honor for me to help. I can reach on Facebook under Rich Minary Foreclosures on YouTube under my name, Max Williams Realtor. Please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks so much for taking the tour. Y'all be safe. Have a great day.